Hey guys, this is Steve from Trim That Weed. In today's video, we're going to discuss why your dryer is not drying and provide quick solutions to these problems. Dryers not drying is a common issue. It happens depending on your dryer settings, the amount of loads you put in the dryer, or if it has worn out. All these issues can cause a dryer not to dry clothes, leaving them damp. The following are some of the common reasons your dryer is not drying. Power supply issues. If you've not correctly plugged in your dryer, it will not function. A dryer needs a sufficient power outlet so it can dry well. You may also have a short in your circuit, which can hinder power usage making the dryer malfunction. Overloading the dryer. An overloaded dryer prevents airflow when the dryer starts spinning. Too many clothing items can prevent sufficient airflow needed to dry clothes, which can result in your clothes being wet when the drying time is over. Blocked filter and air vents. A lint filter prevents lint and debris from entering the air vents so air can freely flow to dry clothes. An air vent allows air to flow within the dryer so clothes can dry. If both are not cleaned regularly, the dirt and lint accumulated over time will result in a blockage, such that air cannot flow and clothes will remain damp. Poorly ventilated dryer. A dryer in an enclosed space like a closet with little ventilation will have little access to the air needed to dry clothes. A poorly ventilated space can make the dryer not dry well. Let us look at the best quick solutions you can apply to stop your dryer from not drying. Fixing the power supply. Ensure you have properly plugged in your dryer. If that doesn't work and the problem is in the circuit, contact an electrician to fix it. Set the correct settings. Each cloth material has its own required dry setting. Number one, do not mix different materials, as each material has a different setting. Number two, for heavier clothes, use the highest heat setting on your dryer. Number three, for lighter clothes, use the least heat setting on your dryer. Number four, if you are unsure which setting to use, set the dryer to auto dry, which will sense when the clothes are dry. Put in little loads at a time. Avoid overloading your dryer. Put the required amount of clothes in your dryer to allow air to flow freely so your clothes can dry. Clean your lint filter and air vent regularly. Cleaning will prevent debris buildup. To clean a lint filter, number one, locate the lint screen at the top or inside the door dryer. Number two, pull it out and remove the lint from the filter with a cloth or hands, or you can soak it. Number three, when done, return it in place. To clean the air vent, one, Locate the air vent found inside or at the back of the dryer. Two, the exterior dryer vent is outside the dryer. Three, disconnect the dryer. Four, use a vacuum to clean the interior air vent and the exterior air vent. Five, use a cloth to clean the cover of the exterior vent with warm soapy water. Six, reconnect the dryer and it is ready to use. Place the dryer in a well-ventilated area. A well-ventilated area for a dryer will allow for more airflow. If it's in a closet space, there should be openings for airflow. Thanks for watching.